It's time for another declutter video. It's time to declutter another brand. Hey everybody, welcome and welcome back to my channel. It is your girl, J Ross, back with another video. And as you guys can tell by the title down below and by the thumbnail, all that good stuff, we are back with another full brand declutter, declutter, <laughs> full brand declutter video. And for those of you who are part of the J Crew J Fam faithful members, you know exactly what we are decluttering next because this show is empty. I'll give you a hint. It deals with this thing right here. Not the Lion King part, but this beautiful house. Y'all not y'all not getting this. This this stays with me. So I am decluttering my P Louise collection. Yes, I know you guys are probably like, have you ever even used that? No, that's what we're going to do today. Okay, that, that's what we're going to do today. So it's going to be like I did for the previous place. I'm going to declutter the items and then the second part of this video will be me actually using um, some of the items. So this declutter is going to actually be weird because I don't have a full face and a lot of the products I have not used yet. And I feel that probably best and probably time to just sell it to you guys because most of them are not even opened. So we got a lot to talk about. You guys really love the Juvia's Place. I've been loving reading your comments. But if you have not watched those two videos, we completely decluttered my Juvia's Place collection. I didn't keep that much, but everything that I'm decluttering, if you guys feel free that you guys want to purchase it, please hit me up, let me know, and I will let you know if it's still available. So I'm giving you guys a chance, which are my YouTube people. I'm giving you guys a chance before I post it on my Instagram. And then once it hits my Instagram for probably that one or two day story, then I'm going to take it down and then it's going to the trash or family members. But yeah, I have a lot of stuff and I feel like you guys would want some of the stuff, especially because P. Louise is a UK based brand. So getting it over here, you guys got to pay like customs and all that stuff. But because I have a lot of it, you I mean, I'm saving you guys money. I, I feel like I'm trying to avoid actually decluttering this collection because I've loved it for so much in terms of packaging and all that stuff and how well it's looked on my beautiful shelf and I just don't want to let it go. But I have to. So we should probably do that because it's a lot of stuff. You guys will see the products that came in this beautiful little light up house. I actually killed the batteries during that 25 days of unboxing. So um, yeah, I can't actually light it up right now, but it is. This is, yeah, that's staying. That's, the house is staying. And also ignore the fact that I still have my Christmas decorations up, okay? We are not gonna judge me for that. All right, so there is no way to pick this up all at once as much as I want to. I can't do it. And I'm not gonna try to do it because we all know I am dropping stuff prone. 12 seconds later. Okay, so we have this right here. I know it's in a Macy's box. Ignore that part. Um, But you have the, see, this is why I shouldn't pick up stuff. And then I also have, this box as well. Let me just show you guys a couple of things that I have already that I kind of use a lot from P. Louise. This is the Oso oh Browtiful eyebrow gel, and then this is the Oso oh Browtiful eyebrow pencil, both in the shade Espresso. This is like a thin application pencil, so it's more like a precise brow. And then this is just like, you know, a typical brow gel, but I do love it. I do use it, and it's actually on my brows. Both of these are on my brows right now. Even when I get my brows actually done, which it's time for me to get them done again, but I usually try to set my brows with this, at least if I'm on the go. Natural beat, everyday beat, not no makeup, makeup type beat. I am most likely running this through my brows just to kind of set. Kind of what I used to do with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Clear Brow Gel. I'm doing that with this now. It came in this cute little espresso cup. Well, it, does, it says espresso because that's the shade of it, but it comes in this cute little like cup. This comes in, this set comes in like maybe five or six shades. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. What I use all the time. Everything else has just been sitting in display mode. So. <laughs> I've been buying from P. Louise since like 2020. And my sister cousin, she judges me, judges me on it all the time. She's like, what about that stuff behind you on display? She was like, I know you use some of it, but what about that shelf that has the suitcase on it? And I'm like, yeah, I haven't used that. And she was like, see, you don't even, I said, Shh. 
We're not gonna judge me though. That's what we're not gonna do. Here, this is the Magic and the Memories Cold Nights Warm Hearts. This is just a little cute cup that you can use. It's like a cold drink cup. This is the Passport brush set that comes in that suitcase that I was holding up, but it literally is like a passport book. Very themed like it. Super cool. Do that if you want to. I don't, you know, why not? There's a lot of stuff on here. P. Louise took a lot of time to make this theme oriented, and I really did love this. Like, even on the back, very inspirational things. But I will show you guys the brushes because it's a lot to read on here, so I won't do that. And then, even then, it like comes with a mirror or whatever. Remember, babe, you're winning every day just by not giving up. Take credit, you're killing it. When in doubt, grab some brushes and create magic. The sooner you start believing in yourself, the sooner you will land in your final destination. So, that's what was written on like at the top of this you have the mirror and then there are the brushes i think they're just blending brushes 198 brush the 115 brush 143 brush these are just a bag of the p louise paints i don't use paints like that so i've never tried her paint this is p louise x M -M -M mitchell acid rain nitro glow girl ibiza ecstasy kind of like a grape raver which is more like it's not like a hot hot pink or is it i don't think so this is actually the first time i'm actually opening this box okay it is a hot pink yeah that's a hot pink first come first serve to whoever wants these ceo of this table which is a brush holder um y'all not getting this because i love this but this is from the all i see is science collection we just we just gonna be that there more inspirational stuff on here i really do feel like she takes time to think of stuff to like you know encourage people and you know make people realize what they are worth even if it's just through reading a makeup package let them judge and misunderstand you but never doubt your worth winners focus on winning whilst losers focus on winners become the ceo of your life and watch everything else fall into place no one is cheering harder for you than the person that you used to be stack them up this is money tones which is the pink one look how beautiful that is never touched it never swatched it nothing like that and then this is talk is cheap which is the blue one and then that is this is actually a shimmer shade can you guys see how beautiful that is this is the ceo million which is the purple palette which we will be using today because we are going to do a purple look because it was requested so i'll show you guys the purple one later when we use it i do have two backup versions of them so you guys can buy these if you want first come first time for the best price health is wealth so it's a green tone palette which i've actually never opened so i'm actually going to open it now because i want to see the color story i see why i bought it and y'all not getting it i love how everything that is embossed matches with the shade name so it's like this one is called money medicine oh my gosh that is a beautiful shade like the shift on that shade is gorgeous but it's this one's called money medicine and it has like a medicine bottle in it this is called checkup and it has like a check on it and that's for like all the palettes each shade is embossed with something that matches the you know the shade name so i thought that was really cool and that green is life this is a lip crayon it says smoochy what is the shade oh this isn't the shade speechless this is a sharpenable pencil i feel like it's called like the wedding bundle or whatever so you have bride to be team bride and you have lady in charge but yeah these three are more like natural tone palettes i don't really want to open these because i want you guys to have fresh palettes if you guys want to buy these as a bundle let me know or if you want to buy these separately first come first serve next up we have the bill please lashes these are from the all i see is signs collections those are the lashes you guys know me i don't really wear lashes so i've never used these never opened these they do not come with glue you guys would have to have your own glue but this is the lash so if you buy anything else from me and you want the lashes just let me know and then you can have the lashes as an added gift this is an oh so brow to foam mini eyebrow pencil this is in the shade espresso i'm keeping this not getting rid of this this is one of the p louise basics which is the cosmetic base this is in the shade 
Radiant Rosewood. I'm not gonna keep saying, if y'all want a bundle, y'all want a bundle. If y'all don't want a bundle, ask me for it separately. And if you don't remember the products that I am saying, please timestamp it and then let me know your Instagram name so I can hit you up and then we can talk about, you know, we can talk about it. But yeah, so that's this box. We're done with that. Next up, we have some more eyeshadow bases or the P. Louise Cosmetic Bases. This is one of another one of the basic. This is called Pretty in Pink, which is more like a coral shade. So this is a very beautiful color coral shade. Pretty sure I've never opened this because I don't even use these. So this is the Radiant Rosewood, and then this is the Pretty in Pink. And then I have one more. This is in the shade Rumor 11, which those of you who remember everybody having these in their makeup tutorials because this is like these were the perfect bases for anybody of any color because they had so many colors available. If you're a makeup artist, this was good as well. All that good stuff. Lastly, this is a Prime and Define cosmetic base. This is a face primer. I'm keeping this to try because I don't think I've ever tried it. Okay, so I think in here is everything that came from that thing. So I think I've already kind of separated in the things that I wanted originally when I first unboxed this compared to stuff I didn't want and I was going to sell to you guys and all that good stuff. So first up we have the Had Me Blushing Powder Blush Duo in the shade Love Drunken In My Feelings. There it is. So I'm keeping these because these are my shades. This is the Skin Bling High lighter it's a powdered highlighter in the shade gold mine um for those of you who did not know this actually came in the um calendar like i mentioned i don't know why i'm gonna keep saying that but it came broke like this is the broken one so i did reach out to p louise and they actually did send me um the original one i can show you guys the broken one so if you guys want it you guys can have it um, if you buy anything else from me when it comes to P. Louise, I will actually just throw this in if you want it first come first serve. It's still usable. It's just it broke and I was sad. So I'm going to try to open this up without having it everywhere. That half is like majority product. This, I think it starts like right here. So those of you who are like really good with like depotting and putting stuff back together, if you want this as part of anything else, just let me know and I'll throw this in. Next up we have the home is where the heart is. Look how cute that is. It's like a little 3D like a little town. This is that eyeshadow palette. So I didn't use this but I did swatch this when I unboxed it originally but I can and I will sanitize it and clean it if this is something you guys want. I don't really want this because I have the CEO Million eyeshadow palette. This is the Kiss and Makeup Lip kit this is in the shade stripped and barely there i think stripped is the lip liner barely there is the lip stick i've already swatched this and i know for sure i'm keeping this because this is the sh this shade is right up my alley this is the bad b energy i ain't gonna say the word because y'all ain't about to get me in trouble with my family okay lip conditioner so this is the one that's in the shade sugar cookie and then it is the lip oil Oop, something and this is in the shade, this is the cookie crumble one. It smells so freaking good, guys. There's so many of these sets that they have. Look how cute the packaging is. I'm not going to swatch these, but I just want y'all to see what y'all missing out on. Because this is gorgeous. Look at the shade. Look, look. Y'all see the caramel? Y'all see that caramel shade? On me. And it smells so good. <laughs> it smells absolutely amazing. But yeah, this this is the one that's staying with me. There's a reason why it's staying with me. And I'm sorry y'all can't have this, but it's staying with me. And I will show you guys the pout, the lip pout real quick. It comes like on a keychain. So it's kind of like a lip gloss. Um, I haven't used it yet, but you know, I could try it right now. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. <laughs> Next up, we have the 25th day, which was this big timeless treasure eyeshadow palette this was more of a neutral tone palette so the video that you guys are looking at is the timeless palette that you guys will be getting but if you look online you can purchase this and it comes in a 42 pan palette version but this one that i have in my possession is an 18 pan palette so i just want you guys to know that there is a difference so if you see the palette online and think you know what you're getting i'm showing you guys a video of the exact palette that you will be getting i hope you guys still appreciate that of course i won't sell you guys the 18 
18 pan palette the price of the 42 pan palette it's not something i would do but i did want to let you guys know that this palette that you were receiving is the one that's in the video that i am showing you guys now this is the bride to be palette that i did not open at all so i have two of the bride to be palettes and then one of the other two palettes these p louise lashes this is a new heights that's what the style is once again this does not come with glue so if you want these you have to have your own glue this is definitely going to you guys if y'all want it this is the bath bomb and the shade in the shade and the scent orange chocolate it looks like one of the stay shining lip oils like as you guys just saw like the little crown thing but that's what this is you have another p louise paints cosmetic paint this is in the shade walk this way this is the lip drip in the shade silk and satin i don't think this is one of the shades that i wanted to keep so i don't i'm pretty sure i didn't swatch this but that's the shade satin silk and satin this is another lip drip this is the shade partner in wine which this one was more of a burgundy one those who love like a grape wine merlot colored that will be perfect what is this this is a matte lipstick in the shade rim kissing instead of reminiscing it's rim kissing it's full coverage matte finish hydrating formula in the shade always yours oh i forgot how gorgeous the packaging like the embossment was look at that it's something i would possibly maybe wear but do i need it since i have the other set i don't need this jay i don't need this jay say it say it with me jay you don't need it i might have swatched it but i swatched it on my hand but not my lip but i will wipe these down again for sure this is the good night and glisten moisturizer from p louise skin y'all not getting this the give it a rest eye cream also from p louise skin y'all not getting this either this is a hyaluronic acid rise and shine this is a serum. Stay with me now. Y'all not getting this. All right, cool. As long as we all know, y'all not getting it. What is this? This is the Hala Mini. This is a lip gloss, but I already have the main size one, but this is what that shade is. Make yourself a P. Louise bundle, okay, people? Just go ahead and do it. Another smoochy lip crayon in the shade Privacy sensational and then you have first grade all of these i have swatched but i think i have the one that is the shade i want so i don't really need any of these yeah, i'm good i'm good i have enough lip liners and i'm staring at my lip liner collection right now and they're just begging to be used so i don't need this or speechless see look i talked myself out of getting speechless i'm proud of myself oh this is one of those press the press pigment in the shade fairy dust it's so pretty it's like that like princess and the frog type green it's like the tiana dress green you know like her princess dress not like you know her working dress can y'all see it look at that i'm not gonna use it so i'm gonna leave that for you guys sorry the box is completely destroyed because i couldn't get it open so here's another one of the bad batch energy this is toasted marshmallow and feeling toasty it's more of a lighter shade than the one i have so it's like lighter but i figured i would give you guys one because i don't need both and that's just selfish this is a bubble bath this is the exciting times bubble bath eggnog scented here's the bottle look how cute that is these are liquid blushes it's called the cheek of it i'm only opening the packaging i'm not actually going to open up but it does come with the sponge applicator i will tell you guys that i will try to put up a picture so you guys can see what it looks like but yeah this is gentle ginger tutti frutti shade which is like more of the darker shade of the two and last but not least these are the wet and set but I have no idea what the heck they actually are. Garden Girl. And then this one is Olive Obsession, which is more of like uh, like honey mustard. And then this one's more olive. But neither here nor there. Um, yeah, I don't really know what to do with these. Like, I feel like I just want to throw them in the trash. Because, like, I feel like y'all don't need to deal with this aggravation. But if you buy anything else from me and you want to try these out just for the heck of it, feel free. I will let you guys have them. Because I'm not going to sell them. And I don't even know what the heck to do with them. So... First of all, this thing is gorgeous. Um, I love this thing. I love this packaging. Everything that this thing says on it is pretty awesome. It's pretty, you know, 
it's just it's just me it's so me and i'm like leaning back because that's how big it is um yeah so this is the suitcase like do i know if you can actually travel with this suitcase probably not but if you are a makeup artist i feel like this would be a pretty legit thing to have and you can take the tray out man i would make this my makeup case so bad so this insert thing is removable and then you can just have like a cute suitcase for your displays if you want so here we go ow <laughs> <laughs> all right so this is what it looks like when you open it of course it's like a pouch here it's like another one of the like, marketing cards and all that good stuff um that says more stuff on it i really liked reading all this it was really funny i'm not gonna read it now because ain't nobody got time for that all right without smashing my fingers this right here is where the passport this is the slot where the passport brush kit went and then this slot right here is where the eyeshadow palette went which is right here <laughs> so i'll show you guys that in a second but these two things at the bottom are boarding pass lip kits how legit is that i was like in so much awe when this originally was like um launched or whatever and i've been in awe ever since to the point that i haven't even used this that's how much in amazement i have been about this collection i haven't even used it so this is the business class boarding pass <laughs> I love saying that um it is a lipstick and a lip liner so this is the shade standard which is a hundred percent up my alley this is in the shade take off this is the lipstick that comes with it first class boarding pad in the shade achievements this shade is called heights so this right here is the first class boarding pass lip set this is the business class set Ignore how the swatches are, but if I could have my perfect set, it would be this lipstick in the shade Heights, and then it will be this lip liner in the shade Standards. And that's what I'm keeping. But yeah, there's the boarding passes. So this is the Worldly Eyeshadow Palette, which has like pink sands that just move back and forth. And like you have the globe, the front of the palette has like a compass a logo. And then you pop this bad boy open carefully. I have never even touched this palette as long as I've had it. I don't even think I've ever taken off the sheet until now. Here, here's the little one that came with it. Look at that, isn't it adorable? Yeah, it was in this pouch. Sorry, my bad. Like it was, it was in this pouch. That's where it was. But I knew it came with a primer. Do I keep saying worldly? It's worldy. Here's the thing, guys. Bought this collection when it came out originally, but before they released it, they were doing a giveaway. My biggest gripe with giveaways is you do the giveaway, but then don't draw the winner until after the collection has launched, which is kind of like, so if the person's waiting to find out if they won the giveaway or not, and then it sells out then it sucks so with me i didn't want this to sell out you know i wanted the chance to win the giveaway because it also included some other stuff as well and i won <laughs> i actually won the giveaway so i have two of these world d collections if you guys would like to buy the suitcase you guys will have your own un open i have not even opened the box for it but i will open the box for it to make sure that nothing is broken or anything because i'm decluttering my room it is time that i offer it to you guys so first come first serve am i giving up my set personally i don't know it has literally just been sitting on that shelf i can't give away all my p louise eyeshadow palettes i can't i mean i could keep the this the world d palette and then the stack em up palette and be fine because it's me and this is how you know i preserve my makeup stuff this thing was still sitting in the suitcase before i lifted it up i just didn't want it to fall but this was still in the suitcase so you know it's still like the first time i opened it that's that's how well i do when i keep my makeup packaging other than trying to open box and it rips never neither here nor there let me quickly run through the things that i am keeping and then i will hold up the box of things of, that i am allowing you guys to buy so i am keeping the 
Good Night and Glisten Moisturize. Give it a rest. Eye cream, rise and shine, hyaluronic acid, kiss and makeup, lip kit in the shade stripped and barely there. The also oh browsful eyebrow pencil in the shade espresso and gel and espresso. Skin bling highlighter in the shade gold mine, but there is one that is available for purchasing. Actually, I'm just gonna add it in. If you buy anything from P. Louise and you want the highlighter, just let me know, even though that one is broken. If you feel like you're good at doing the repressing and all that stuff, I will just add that in. You don't have to purchase that. And then I am keeping the Stack 'em Up CEO Million. This is the purple one. Health is Wealth, the green one, and the Talk is Cheap, the blue one. I'm keeping those three. And then this is an Oso Brow Mini, which is also in the shade Espresso. You had me blushing, which is in the shade Love, Drunken in My Feels. Prime and Define Primer. I don't know if it's eye primer or face primer. I guess we're just gonna find out. And then I'm also keeping uh, this tumbler and like I said, this cup, the brush holder that says CEO of this table, it would probably end up on my makeup desk when I declutter more stuff on that. And then I'm keeping this Bad Batch Energy, which we all know doesn't say Bad Batch, but you can put whatever letter you want in there, okay? That's what I'm doing. And this is the sugar cookie and cookie crumble set, which is these two. All right, now we know we know it's, it's fall prone, but there's a lot in here, okay? Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I am your girl, Jay Ross. Please like, share, and subscribe to this channel. Don't forget to comment down below if you want any of this stuff in this video before I fully toss it to the trash or it goes to the family. And it will also hit Instagram, but I'm giving you guys the opportunity first to check it out probably like a week or two after I post this video, then it will go to Instagram. But you guys have a chance to check it out, as well as the Juvia's Place stuff that I did in my last um, set of videos for the declutter series. I am proud of myself for what I am getting rid of. Hard to like declutter that stuff because I bought most of it to use and then I never used it because it just looks so beautiful on that shelf. But I am okay with uh, probably like 90%, 95% of it because I just don't know if I'm going to fully give away that second, not give away, but allow you guys to purchase the worldy collection that I fully have, that I've opened and it's been on my shelf, but I have never used it. Shut your mouth, Wild. I love you guys more than you guys will ever know. Shout out to us for getting over 600. Shout out to us for making it for six years. Shout out to those of you that have supported the KJ Ross Productions brand ever since I posted my story and my journey with that. You guys have been showing me nothing but love. I cannot wait to work with some of you guys. Opportunities have just been opening ever since I posted that. So I'm so glad that you guys cared for me on Instagram through that post. And I'm so glad that those of you that have supported me and saw my first video when I return back and heard about my story as well i'm glad you guys have been supporting me through that if you want to support me but don't want to buy any of the makeup please go ahead and leave me something in my paypal tip jar i'll make sure to leave it pop up down below and it will be linked down below for you guys as well just support your girl in any way possible let the lord bless you to bless me i'm just saying so i hope you guys are staying safe happy healthy and blessed as i always say and then don't forget to share like subscribe all that good stuff love you guys and i'll see you guys in my next one.